Okay, so literally 10 seconds into starting this vlog. Uh, security guy stopped me because I was taking a picture of Modi ji. And there are Modi ji pictures everywhere, right? So I'm allowed to take pictures of Modi ji. And then he was like, the cow? What is all this? And I showed him everything. And then I had to show the beginning of my vlog to him. And he's like, what are you doing? I'm like, journalist? Ho? I'm not, but still. I was like, what are you doing here? I was like, sir, I'm covering G20. Modi ji did a good job. No. And then he's like, okay, 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 go, go. Great start to vlogging, huh? Very exciting. I, I get why people do this. Uh, so I just told uh, Ashokda here. Ashokda is our friend Ashokda <laughs> that uh, what happened in the airport. Kya bol rahe the Ashokda? Ekna didi chhobi dille kichhi bolva na modi chhobi dille bolva. He said that if we if I took picture if I took pictures of Didi, kuch bolenge nahi modi ka thi tum picture loge to problem ho jayega. You know, I, I don't understand why our uh, security establishment is so paranoid, right? I mean, there are people taking photos all the time at airports, like outside the airport, outside the plane. They're just like, ah, plane, dekho, plane. And I just took a Modi ji ka photo and stopped. Actually, that security guy became the first viewer of my vlog, I realized. Vlog, vlog, this is a vlog. He became the first viewer of my vlog before you. Guys, we are Modi ji. Look, we are going to take it now. We are going to go the airport. Where is Didi? Where is Didi? 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 Show me Didi. Didi is coming. Didi is coming. Didi is coming. Hello Bashi, Bangla, we love Bengal. Okay guys, everyone loves Bengal. Everybody loves Didi. Abhi aayenge fir se, I think kai to bhi fir se Didi ji aayenge. But pehle Modi ji aaye. Hai na Ashok da? Pehle Modi ji aaye, fir Didi aaye. To matlab, aapko samaj gaya na kya ho raha hai? Arre aage Didi fir se. that I don't know what to do in a vlog so I saw a few vlogs on uh, YouTube abhi, just quickly to see what they're doing so there is this category of classy vlogs done by white people and then there is this other category of Indian vlogs and uh, so I think I should do an Indian introduction also right because this is for an Indian audience okay wait hello guys hum aaj aapko ek vlog dikhane wale hai हम अभी कोलकाता में हैं, जस्ट लैंड हुए हैं। हमारे साथ अशोक दामी है यहाँ पे, जो बिल्कुल अम्यूज नहीं दिख रहे हैं। और हम आज मजे करने वाले हैं। ओके फ्रेंड्स, चलते हैं मजे करने। थैंक्स। That is my favorite building in Kolkata. Whenever we come here. For a while, it's like it's like how when you go to Bombay and uh, they have this monument called Antilla. It's the same thing. Yahan pe bhi ek thoda sa Antilla ka feel aa gaya. There's like this nice bridge in the middle. I think you know Ambani ji should buy uh, buy something here and build an Antilla also. This this city needs desperately needs a monument. in the morning and uh, I'm supposed to I'm, I'm going for a morning walk and uh, I asked on my server yes we have a discord server by the way members of the discord server which you can check out and I was asking please how do you vlog and they said uh, just do 
stream of consciousness talking just uh, do like random shots of random things and do stream of consciousness talking so that's what we are going to do yeah 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 that's what this whole exercise is about look at that there is a tree and there are crows the crows fly around merrily as if they are free they used to say that birds are the inspiration behind why human beings were given rights of freedom but then now we know that humans don't have the right to freedom but these crows do they just going about it you freaking crows i'm so jealous of you kachra kha rahe ho very nice well done this general update on my channel uh, so one of my clips went kind of crazy viral uh, dhruv rathi shared it and it went not it was that clip about sunset tv you know and its camera and takes you can see it on my channel it was a part of the dispatch 4 of parliament watch so there is a lot of new audience that just suddenly came in they were saying two things i had put up a story saying oh this clip is going viral so hello to all the new followers who are coming in and then a lot of people came in saying oh but this went viral because of dhruv rathi not because of the clip itself you should thank him and i was like yeah i did i did dm him and thank him but his followers are very cult like which is fine i mean i guess uh, he has a great fan following bjp used to be here see those symbols are gone i had come during the elections and there was a lot of of course bjp stuff also happening here no more no more didi has wiped out bjp completely no not completely but they are still the second biggest opposition i believe hello another crow are you enjoying your freedom does didi give you freedom do you feel free in this state please tell us please you don't right modi ji sahi kehte hai is that the kind of stuff i am supposed to do yes yeah okay i'll do the next one from the park which i'm going to now random shots and random music see you there the thing that uh, people said was oh you should do your content in hindi man uh, you will reach a lot more people because andhavaks need to know what is going on and they don't understand english honestly i don't want to i'm okay with english i'm more comfortable with english and uh, i feel like there is a lot of non hindi speaking audience also no when i asked on the server someone said that oh why do you why do you you should make non political vlog i don't think that's possible did you see this channel did you see what happens on this channel yeah did you see how we talk only about politics and nothing else so no this vlog is not going to be non political there is no such thing as non political everything is political as they say the personal is also political way back when the feminist movement was happening 
this term was coined called the personalist political where women were arguing that if they make their personal problems political and they are political that is the only way to change them things like you know their right to bear children their right to abortion sexuality gender all of these things can only be changed if they are made political so so this blog is also political yes vlog vlog not blog video log is what this is I think this whole obsession of doing content in Hindi uh, is I don't agree with it because I know there's a lot of Hindi speaking population in India and people are like oh agar you know popular hona hai viral hona hai to do it in Hindi but I don't know man I'm okay with having just a quality English audience for this channel rather than just going after numbers and expanding my base if people want to see it they will see it and it's not like i'm using too complicated of english so that people don't understand it is the second most spoken language in india right now so i have hopes and i will continue doing my content in english because i'm more comfortable in it it's as simple as that <laughs> Uh, I don't know if I'll keep this vlog also. I'll maybe put it up, then people will be like, "Hey, what are you doing?" And I'll remove it in like a few days. Maybe that's not going to happen. Or maybe this will do so well that maybe this channel will become a vlogging channel. What do you know? Maybe you know. Life is strange. We have no agenda. We have no plans. just like modi ji and his government so we'll see where it goes right Cat, do you think I should do vlogging? Cat, do you think? Huh? Yes. Oh, you agree? and then there were like a host of of course bhakts that came in who were like oh you specifically are talking about uh, you're just covering opposition speeches and you're criticizing the government in power that's the whole point this entire channel is going to be biased against those who are in power just letting you know uh, so your arguments about being fair and being balanced and just criticizing the opposition and the government and also praising the opposition and the government i don't do that i see who has power right now in any given situation and i criticize them and i highlight those who do not have power when the government switches when the power switches it will remain the same i will be very consistent about that i will question those in power 
that's the idea of this channel i hope that gives you some clarity i guess this is one of the reason why i should do vlogging to just clear my stands yeah maybe that's the idea here right finally figured it out maybe anyway see you in the next one